Yeah, let's start with it, right? We would know what an analytical passage is and, and what is, and how to, how to uh, use whatever we have learned in the next paragraph. Take care of the passage. Take care. Sixth mein wo dekhenge, and fifth mein we would see the analytical one. Now read it and just let me switch on this. Okay. Okay, okay. Yes, you have the reading passage five in the last uh, file. ठीक है. अभी मैं तुमको दूसरा file दे रहा हूँ. जो अगला वाला करेंगे. ठीक है. Let's do this first, and then I would provide you with the second file.
Yep, the time is over. So let us move to the fifth parent, right? Fifth passage. I hope you can see it. Are you done? Bolo, yar. Yes, sir. Okay. So, first question would be the third one that we would be attempting. The tone of the author in the passage is, let me know. Yes. Okay, there were certain paragraphs in this. I have to make the adjustments. Just a sec. Okay, so let us see. There were certain paragraphs in this one, right? One was like this. Okay. I hope you can see this. Yeah. So there was a paragraph from here to here. Okay, mark it down. I would provide you different file after this and the second paragraph was from here that's not to say okay so rolling may leave you and that's not to say fine okay let's move to the question now okay now I've got only two answers here. 
I have got only two answers here. So which one would be the tone of the author? Which one would be the tone of the author? Yeah. Okay. Now, what is the difference between a uh, mesmerizing would not come right? This, this is an extreme type of tone. He is not mesmerized by the author. Okay. The second thing that is appreciating, analytical, and critical. Okay. What is the difference between analytical and critical? Let me know. Why analytical? Why not appreciating and critical if uh, several of you have chosen just a minute? See, okay, analytical, analytical, appreciating. Okay, one has chosen appreciating. Sashwat has chosen analytical. Why analytical? If you have chosen analytical, why analytical? And if you have chosen, why appreciating? Let us see. Let us go through the passage once again. Okay. Rolling may leave you dissatisfied with the surprisingly slap dash. Dissatisfied, right? Okay. In this, they were talking about dissatisfied and then they were talking about you care to, for Harry when he goes hold whatever the relationships and all, and yet again, one last time into Rawlings writings, right? Other reason we buy. Uh, all have their places, but the wise Umbalos once put is the graces and the most powerful magic is love. Okay, now. Mm, that's not to say deathly allows is anything less than a nail biting raid, right? That means he has, he has talked about negative points of the book before this okay so i would not go with b i would not go with b appreciating would not be the answer then right he has given us several shortcomings of the book now between analytical and critical which one should be the which one should be the tone let me know Critical may be positive and negative. Both points are given. In analytical too, both points are given. Why not uh, D? In analytical, I think we arrive at some conclusion, right? But the, no. there is the pros and cons and no. then they come. So critical may wo ek mulk, ek se impartial okay puri cheese ko dekta, I think. Hmm. And uh, in this uh, para, he's not uh matlab, puri ek se bias nahi hai kisi cheez ke par. He's both uh, feel good about the novel and is feeling uh, something uh, is wrong about the novel. So he's uh, hmm. appreciating both the sides of this. Hmm. Sir, so should be uh, sir, critical mein, sir, pros and cons direct baat hoti hai. To mm -hmm. the, sir, yahan pe analytic yani wo analysis kar raha hai with it sab, matlab, jo author hai, uh, to, of the passage, he wants to say ki, matlab, aapne agar pehle ki ye books padhi hoi hai, to usme ye differences hai, isme, to, sir, a kind of analysis is been there. To, sir, isi liye mm -hmm. maine analytical choose kiya hai, e, matlab, mujhe yahan pe difference yadhi kata hai, critical mein, matlab, you have to, you have either plus or either minus, but, sir, yahan pe kya hai, Ultimately, sir, you compare kar hai ki aap se rolling se aisa aap ho, but wo disappoint kar rahe hai thoda sa. But the, at the end, Dumbledore, jo kehte hai, it is all about love. So ultimately, sir, wo analysis wali baat mujhe lagi thodi thi. Yeah, critical involves both positive and negative, right? You are writing a critique of something. Okay. So let us see why this would be not critical. Theek hai? Ab dekh lete hai. So, why is B and D 
insufficient. What's new in Deathly Hallows, however, is that this first time it's an all-out war. Okay. Okay. Now he goes. He goes to different areas, right? Different areas where he compares rolling, right? These parallel brings about the some inevitable dissonances, whatever. When Hermione runs over the checklist of before, whatever, right? As laughably childish. Let us see the difference between C and D. Analytical and critical. Okay. So the analytical uh, tone remains generally of a generally of a examining of the information. Right, examining of the information. So, are we examining the information, or were we doing an analysis? Critical. Okay, these are these are same. Okay, ये बहुत ज़्यादा close होते हैं. Critical and analytical. Critical is also an analysis. Critical is also an analysis. Right. So, I would say that you cannot make the distinction between these two. ठीक है. Critical is also a type of analysis. Okay, you cannot make a distinction between these two. So you have to be careful while we you are taking you are taking these two options. Okay, now I do not think so. Any distinction is between these, but in my source it had been given. So I didn't think that this should be given. Okay. Fine. So right answer is analytical critical. Right answer is analytical. ठीक है, but analytical is also a type of okay. Critical is also a type of analysis. ठीक है ना तो वो भी analytical में ही आएगा. ठीक है. Let me find the difference. ठीक है ना मैं थोड़ा सा difference देख लेता हूँ. Okay. So critical has been given. The definition of critical has been given. Waiting up the arguments, right? And analytical has been given. Examining the information, the information. Okay. So, दोनों में difference क्या है? What is the difference in both two? According to the definition, sir, I have also seen it. So, hmm. sir, analytical tone of passage is that the presence of reason or logic to support something. Hmm. Okay. And sir, critical, sir, it is just defining yes, it is wrong. Hmm. Here, at the end, the author is showing his love towards J.K. Rowling or uh, J.K. Rowling's writing or Harry Potter. Oh. Hmm. I'm glad that we have reached the answer in these terms. So, in analytical, the person can reach to an answer. Okay, how? अब हम analysis कहाँ करते हैं while reaching to a conclusion in an experiment. How do we do that? Observation. हाँ, we observe something. We make two to three. Hypothesis, ठीक है ना? We make two to three hypotheses. Then we conduct experiments on those hypotheses on the basis of those hypotheses, or we make the hypothesis earlier, and then we conduct experiments on it, and then we make the conclusion. ठीक है? This is analytical. Critical में क्या होता है? We write a critic. We write the positive and negatives of both, and we do not think that. The positives way over negatives. Okay, done. Match कर रहा है कि नहीं definition से? बताओ. Hello. 
you have seen your own definition is it matching the definition or not yeah. sir ek definition par ye bhi likha hua hai critical ka ki expressing or involving an analysis of the merits and faults of a work of literature hmm same same but he is going towards one direction let us see here uh rolling may leave you dissatisfied with where her villain goes about nefarious business she may leave you quibbling over her seemingly inexhaustible stock of narrative coincidences but you brush aside these concerns because you care about the characters you care about harry and when he gets hold of a letter so in the end he talks about there are certain shortcomings but you get hold of the book right this thing makes it analytical rather than critical theek hai understood okay theek hai chalo to iska reading capacity mein he said that this is a good book to read theek hai this won't be critical chalo do you want to do the other two questions बोलो या अगले वाले में चले सर कर लेते हैं दोनों क्वेश्चन और भी ठीक है ओके द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू यू हैव टू मिनट्स टू डू दिस राइट डू यू नीड द टाइमर टाइमर चाहिए कि नहीं नो नो ठीक
Yeah. Okay, B. We have options such as B, C, B. The author would agree with the which of the following. Okay. Rolling freely lifts concepts and examples from others' works, hence is guilty of plagiarism. Okay, I don't think so. Such negative stance has been made for rolling. Okay. Nobody has given me a answer. Okay. B. The fact that Harry can sense the movements of his nemesis by means of a scar reduces to some extent the sense of danger created by the book. Okay. Was this the case? Let us see. Let us see. This is a difficult one. It is a difficult one. Let us see whether this is possible or not. B, kya hoga? B, B, B. Kaan pe diya hua Nail biting read. Hmm. Where was it given? I can find it. Hmm. Scar, cloak, whatever. Sir, laughably childish. Ke baad Yes. Psychological connected scar. Psychically connected scar means that he was the fact that Harry can sense the movements of his nemesis by means of reduces some extent the sense of danger created by the book. Let us see whether he means that or not. Where was it? Scar, scar, scar. Mm, yeah. Okay. Another factor that eats considerably into the elements of dangerous. Yes, that is correct. Right. B is correct. So according to this sentence, this is the correct one. B is the correct one. Let us see if they have given the C or the D options or not. In the book, Rowling could have avoided creating circumstances and instances which have closely close similarity with real world terror as these circumstances or instances are laughably childish. Okay. Hmm. He hasn't said that she could have avoided, though he has given the instances that are laughably childish, right? Before the sentence that we went through just now. Rowling's seemingly inexhaustible stock of narratives make it difficult to appreciate the elements of love. He has not said that it was difficult to appreciate the element of love. Right. It was constant along all the relationships. Right. Okay. So B would be the right answer. Easy tha ya difficult tha? Easy. 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 Another factor that eats considerably into the element of danger. Another factor that eats considerably. Okay, eats considerably into the element of danger. That means that lowers the bar of danger. Right? Decreases the element of danger. Okay. That has been given. Okay. Why? Because Voldemort is sensed comfortably ahead of time by Harry and thanks to his because of this. Okay. Understood. Yeah, I was but I think I was considerable or to some small extent. To some hmm. extent, I confused. Okay. Which of the following statements best represents the author's feeling about Deathly Hallows?
ओके ये बात बताओ वेदर इट वॉज गिवन दैट इट इज डिफरेंट और इट इज सिमिलर सर इट सिमिलर सिमिलर ना yeah. तो इसको बाहर निकाल देते हैं राइट फर्स्ट पार्ट हैज गिवन अस दिस इंफॉर्मेशन या बिटवीन बी एंड सी anel biting reed which succeeds in arousing emotions of love and care through its portrayal of relationship in spite of there being appropriations from other either other words see okay let us see a story with real world underpinning which is nail biting reed and succeeds in arousing emotions of love and care th through its portrayal of relationship in spite of excessive narratives okay What is the difference here? There being appropriations from other works, or there being excessive narratives. What was the overall tone of this passage? Negative or positive? First of all, right. Whenever you do a tone question, remember you have to know which one are negative and which one are positive. Right? Okay. Now, let me know. क्रिटिकल वाला क्रिटिकल वाला न्यूट्रल में आएगा मेरे ख्याल से एक बार देख लेना ऐसे करके व्हेन यू वुड व्हेन यू वुड डिवाइड दीज टोन्स इनटू डिफरेंट इनटू डिफरेंट ग्रुप्स इंक्लूडिंग द पॉजिटिव नेगेटिव एंड न्यूट्रल यू वुड गेट ऑल द आंसर्स करेक्टली ठीक है दिस वुड हेल्प यू इन एलिमिनेटिंग द ऑप्शंस ठीक है चलो हां टोन इज पॉजिटिव टोन इज पॉजिटिव सो व्हिच ऑप्शन हैज द टोन पॉजिटिव I think C. C has the tone positive. Hello. Let us see this. Right. Now against an evil regime with real world underpinnings. Right. Or here, what is it? We are at war against an evil regime. okay deathly hallows is a story where rebels a story with real world independence here they are telling about an evil regime with a real world underpinning they are they, here they are saying that a story with real world underpinnings okay this is one and the overall tone of the story was positive right here they have included this which was not that much often important which was not that much of an important uh, peculiarity right or information that made the book vulnerable okay so b would be the right answer rather than c because of these two points understood bolo sir can you explain again ai yahan pe dekho na have a look here पे क्या हो स्टोरी विद रियल वर्ल्ड अंडर प्रिंस हेयर एन इविल रिजीम विद रियल वर्ल्ड अंडर प्रिंस वॉट वॉज इट द स्टोरी वॉज रियल वर्ल्ड और द इविल रिजीम वॉज रियल वर्ल्ड द स्टोरी राइट ऑन दैट बेसिस बी वुड बी द आंसर अदर इज दिस नेगेटिव कॉन्टेशन हेयर राइट इन स्पाइट ऑफ देयर बींग एप्रोप्रिएशन फ्रॉम अदर वर्क right it was not that much of a worrisome information or detail that worried the author he was always positive towards the author of harry potter right who is jk rowling samajh me aa gaya na bolo yes theek hai any questions here bolo Any questions here? Tone वाला सबको समझ में आ गया था एनालिटिकल क्यों चुना Yes sir. Okay. Done. Done with this. Right. I am sending you the another file. Just a minute. I am getting a call.
Yeah, yeah sending you the file. Uh, just a second. Done. Let me know if you didn't receive it. जूम चैट में देखना ठीक है हैव अ लुक इन द जूम चैट ओके देन आई वुड हैव टू सेंड इट इन टू द चैट्स जस्ट अ सेकेंड Naresh has got it. Vicky and Sushant didn't. I have sent the message to everyone. I don't know why this is happening. Yeah. So I hope it is clear that some parts of it was narrative. Okay. I was being taken to a small wadi. Whenever I and the story behind that is included, that would be narrative, right? it is for the recording now the second thing was descriptive the passage is descriptive but it has some changes here right the passage goes into the past tense which is not present hence it cannot be descriptive again let us say that it was descriptive right it was descriptive the truth is most astounding still what i was looking at was an evidence of a i said now he is giving us the evidences right which is not present there so it makes it analytical rather than a descriptive one and the argumentative style is not the style of this passage why because argumentative style would have been for example bjp is not doing good right i would give some examples to prove this argument that i am making so this is the difference and hence d would be the right answer ha huh. next question karne hai implications of the authors observation regarding the rocks of an arabian peninsula this is important right what is the implication of the authors observation regarding the rocks in arabian peninsula do that question till that i would make the video theek hai na or another um, point to be noticed for the people who are watching this video right the question is asking the predominant style the predominant style is different from the styles of the paragraphs whenever this question arises there would be some styles of the paragraphs also present which is different from the overall para overall tone of the passage yes the answer for the first one
Okay, answer one is A. Someone has written the Arabian Peninsula was covered in glaciers not too long ago. Yeah, the author's observation regarding the rocks in Arabian Peninsula. We have to move to the passage. Take care. The author's observation regarding the rocks of the Arabian Peninsula. Hmm. The rocks. Where are the rocks? The rocks of all shapes and sizes were struck into grayish clay of cliffs like plums in a pudding. There seem to be various kinds of rock types, okay? Even pieces of granite. Yet too loose, so loosely were they held that clay that some of them could be plucked out of the cliffs. It took a small piece of some kind of fine grade and reserve at the close quarters only there were. But this was obviously a tough rock. So whether the, whatever had done the scratching and polishing must have exercised some considerable pressure. Okay. So on the basis of this, what can we what can we conclude? The implications of the author's observation regarding the rocks of the Arabian Peninsula. What one, what would be the answer? Only one person has given me the answer. Okay. The Arabian Peninsula was covered in glaciers not too long ago. Is it regarding the rocks? I cannot say. Within a few thousand years, a glacier-filled valley can turn into a hot desert. In the past, the entire earth was so called that even the entire earth is completely wrong. Within a few thousand years, a glacier filled valley can. Regarding the rocks in implication, kya hai iska? Koi implication mujhe dikhai nahi de I don't think so. There was an implication. Okay. Let us reach to the implication. We have to reach to the implication. Okay. Again, rock has come in complete contrast to the the whole valley floor has stepped whatever, right? No implication given. The truth is more astounding still. What I was looking at the evidence of an ice age here, now there are beating sun, hot frying pan, whatever. Coarse boulders which had been included in these glaciers carried along the blunt, whatever many tons of ice had provided the necessary pressure to pursue, uh, produce what could now be recognized as glacial pavement. Okay. <clears throat> so, this is relevant to Arabian Peninsula only. So, this is the implication of this. Has he given this? Let us see. C is out of the question because entire earth has not been given. It was relevant to any Arabian Peninsula only. Within a few thousand years, a glacier filled valley can turn into hot desert. Okay. Again, Arabian Peninsula was there, not only the valley. Right. The Arabian Peninsula was covered in glaciers not too long ago. Okay. It might be the answer, but not too long ago. Would that be the answer? Not too long ago. Have they given the, uh, have they given the time limit? No, sir. They haven't given the time frame. Hmm. Not too long ago, because there is none of the above for event. What do you say? The last time right. ancient peninsula, likha hai na, toh, I guess not too long ago. By ancient, to kitna bhi piche ho sakta hai na? Nah, 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 not too long ago, toh, bahut chota ho gaya na. Manab, too long ago. Manab, 10-15 saal ho sakta hai. Haan. Saal bhi ho sakta hai, but really, really to... small. It is vague. Uh -huh. mm. Right. It is vague. So I would go with none of the above. Okay. This was a difficult question. Should be left in the exam if none of the above has been given. Right. Okay. The other question. Inferred about glaciers. This is a fact based. I won't be doing this. Fourth one. Okay. Ye tumhare upar hai. Fifth one, which of the following, if true, would most weaken the author's conclusion in the passage? Okay, this is an assumption one. This would be an easy one. Do it first. Right, I'm giving you one minute and then we would do the inference question.
Hmm. Okay. What most weakened the author's conclusion in this passage? What, what was the author's conclusion? First of all, what was the author's conclusion? We need to have a clear idea about that. What was the that author's conclusion? In ancient time, Arabian Peninsula was an, uh, covered in ice. Hmm. And that created all those effects. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, which option should come on the basis of that? Right. So we, we, have can find ke liye hmm. we have to find something that might have created all those effects. Okay. Taken the stones from one place to another. Right. And created all those efforts that is uh, creating the pressure and the passage. Right. So, flash floods would be another, another such instance which can create these, these effects. Right. Scientists who study ancient climate have shown that Arabian Peninsula was colder in the past. Colder doesn't mean there was ice. So, this is irrelevant. New research has indicated that parts of Arabian Peninsula was, were much wetter. Hello? Wetter means there was water, not ice present. Right. Or the pressure was not released. Right. Wetter means it might have some more water than the present condition, right? It was not a desert. It might be like an Indian plain, okay, geographical plains. There are many places on the earth that have some kind of rocks than the author. absurd. This is all together. Right. Only A satisfied what we have observed. Remember, you need to uh, you need to retain the observation and the conclusion made on that in an analytical passage, right? Now. Inference. <clears throat> Glaciers from this passage, they are found in D. May last make Obi Likana point. This may be a or D. May conclusion. The Yavala, if you want to see identical work, you must go to Norway or Canada. What does that mean? A flash floods are, but the world also counteract me. Nope. If true, would most weaken the author's country. That means. It would say that flash floods, not ice or glaciers, were responsible. Okay. Right. Okay. No, there are many places on the earth. It is not relevant. Conclusion okay. kya isme amara. What was the conclusion? That ice glaciers are responsible for all those rocks and those markings. ठीक है अच्छा नाउ वी हैव टू डू दिस राइट वी हैव रेड दिस इन द अजम्पशंस क्लास राइट यू नीड टू नो द कंक्लूजन इन अ स्टोरी राइट दैट वुड बी देयर इन आर्गुमेंटेटिव एज़ वेल एज़ एनालिटिकल पैसेजेस ठीक है चलो व्हाट कैन बी इनफर्ड अबाउट द ग्लेशियर्स फ्रॉम दिस पैसेज दे कैन मूव लार्ज बोल्डर्स अराउंड वी कैन इनफर दिस दे टेंड टू फ्लैटन द लैंडस्केप अराउंड देम ये है क्या यस डिड दे फ्लैटन द लैंडस्केप ओके यहां पे क्या दिया हुआ है लेट मी सी ठीक है व्हाट हैज बीन गिवन हियर सी वोंट बी द आंसर राइट दे टेंड टू फ्लैटन द लैंडस्केप दे डिड नॉट फ्लैटन द लैंडस्केप डिड दे नो Right. If you would check, they did not flatten the landscape. Okay. They wash away the rocks around when they melt. If they washed away the rocks, right? How are the rocks present there? How are the boulders present there? Right. That means it first melted and then it went down the drain. So it won't be the answer. They can move large boulders around. Yes, this was there. Right. They can move, but not wash away. Okay. Wash away was extreme. Right. Okay, they can move. They are found mainly during ice ages. Are glaciers found mainly during ice ages? I do not think so. Right. This is too broad because glaciers are found in north caps of the earth. Right. So B would be the right answer. That is all for today. ठीक है जाओ ठीक अब match देखो. आप भी आओगे क्या? अरे मैं नहीं आ पाऊँगा मेरे पास तो आया हूँ. ठीक है. चलो. Okay bye. क्यों क्या हुआ